What is up everybody, Garden State Aviation here, back with another video. This is the March 2022 Newark Liberty International Airport update. Without further ado, let's get started. Pushing back at gate S1 or Sierra 1, we have this GA 777-200ER. This is in their continental slash old livery. He's pushing back for a flight out to Los Angeles. Next to him, we have this Spirit A321 in their Bidez livery. The reason why he's in an international state is because he came in from a special charter flight from Medellin, Colombia. But uh, later today, he'll be towed to the domestic slash mainline stands uh, to prepare for a normal flight out to Fort Lauderdale. At the next stand, here we have this United 787-10. This is in their Blue Evolution slash new livery. Earlier today, he came in from a flight from Paris, and tomorrow morning, he'll be loading up for an early morning flight out to Tel Aviv. Here we have yet another 787. This one is a 787-9 in United's Blue Evo livery. Earlier today, he came in on a flight from Cape Town, and tomorrow evening, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Tokyo and Narita. Here we have this Lufthansa A350-900. This is in their new livery. Earlier today, he came in from Munich, and this evening, he'll be loading up passengers for his return back out to Munich. Here on the taxiway between the two sides of the airport, we have this French B A350-900. He's taxiing for flight out to Paris Orly. Just taxiing out, just pushing back. Here we have this Air India 787-8. This is in their Mahatma Gandhi livery. He's pushing out for a special cargo flight out to Chennai, India. Moving on to the domestic slash mainland stands. Here we have this United Express Embraer ERJ-175. Earlier today, he came in on a flight from Providence, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Charleston. Pushing back next to the 175, here we have this American 737 MAX 8. He's pushing out for a flight out to Miami after coming in from Dallas earlier today. Here at the next stand, we have this United 737-700. This is in their Blue Evolution slash new livery. He just pulled in from a flight from Sacramento and later today, home loading up passengers for a flight out to Jackson. Next to him, we have another United 737-700. This one is in their Continental slash old livery. Earlier today, he came in on a flight from San Antonio and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to St. Martin. Pulling in at gate S13 or Sierra 13, we have this United 737-900 in their Continental Retro livery. He's coming in from a flight from Puerto Plata in the Dominican Republic. Moving on to the other side of the mainline slash regional stands, here we have this United 757-200. This is in their Blue Evolution slash new livery. Early today, he came out on a flight from Fort Myers, and later this evening, he'll be up passengers for a flight out to Orlando. Next to him, we have this United 757-200. This is in their Her Art here in New York, New Jersey livery. He just came in on a flight from Orlando, and later this evening, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Eagle, Colorado. Here at gate S27, or Sierra 27, we have this United 737 MAX 8 in their Blue Evolution slash new livery. Earlier today, he came in on a flight from Tampa, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Las Vegas. And moving on to the last aircraft in the domestic slash mainline slash regional stands, we have this Delta Connection CRJ-900. Earlier today, he came in on a flight from Raleigh-Durham, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Cincinnati. Moving on to the cargo stands here, pushing back, we have this Galeta Air 747-400 in their Not Without My Mask livery. He's pushing uh, out for a flight to Dover Air Force Base. Moving on to the final aircraft of this airport update, here at gate C1, or Charlie 1, we have this UPS MD-11. Early today, he came in on a flight from Louisville, and later today, he'll be loading up cargo for a flight back out to Louisville. That being said, that's concluded this video. If you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, and turn the notification bell so you my videos, and comment down below which guys think I should improve in my videos. Once again, thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. As always, goodbye.